In this video, I'm going to show you how to build AI chatbots with no experience and no money. And then I'm going to show you how to connect these AI chatbots to small local businesses. And for this, the business owner is going to pay us anywhere between $97 to $497 a month. Now with this AI software, I collect payments just like this every single day. And the best part about this is that this is going to be recurring revenue. So this means at the end of each month, my revenue is going to constantly be growing. This isn't just a one and done service. Once we hook the business owner up to this AI bot, they're going to be paying us for a very long time, if not forever, because it's going to be very stupid for a business owner to cancel because with this AI bot, we're literally going to be making them a ton of money. We're going to be saving them a ton of time. So that's why this business model right here is very sticky. And that's how we're able to consistently increase our revenue month after month. Now, what are the benefits of this AI chatbot. Like I said before, this AI chatbot will significantly cut costs for the business owner. This is going to save them a ton of money from having to go out there and hire entire employees. This bot can do everything an employee would be able to do. And the best part about this AI bot is that this AI bot will work around the clock. So that means this bot won't have to take any breaks, it won't have to sleep, it won't have to eat. It's literally going to be working inside of the business 24 seven and no employee would be able to do that. Also, this bot is going to save the business owner a ton of time because it's going to automate multiple business processes. It's also going to be able to handle multiple tasks at once. So those are some of the benefits of this bot. Now before to build an AI bot just like this, we would have to use like 10 different types of softwares, connect them all together and doing it that way could be confusing. It can also be very expensive because we would have had to pay for multiple different types of softwares. But now to build this AI bot, we're just going to be using one software and this software right here will literally take us less than 30 minutes to set up. It's going to be that fast and it's going to be extremely powerful. No longer do we have to shuffle through multiple tools, piece everything together and hope that everything works. Now this process has been simplified. We can just use one tool. It's a very easy to set up tool and it's not going to take us that long to do it. Now business owners only care about one thing. They don't care about how we built the bot or all the technical details that went behind it. They only care if our bot booked them appointments because the more appointments that a business owner gets, the more money they're going to be making. Now our bot is so powerful that with our AI bot, we're going to be able to do that for the business owner. We're going to automate their appointment booking process. The AI bot's going to take over. It's going to communicate with their leads, with their customers, and it's automatically going to book appointments on the business owner's calendar. So the business owner doesn't have to worry about anything. All they have to do is look at their calendar and they're going to see a bunch of days booked out. And now all they have to do is fulfill those appointments. And that's that. So like I said before, this AI bot is going to make the business owner a ton of money. So they're not going to mind paying us a small monthly fee for this. So I'm going to quickly go ahead and show you how to build out this AI bot for small small local businesses. So to build out this AI chatbot, we're going to be using a platform called Go High Level. Now we're using Go High Level because Go High Level is a really powerful AI software. And the best part about Go High Level is that we can actually white label their entire platform. As you can see here, this no longer says Go High Level anywhere. This is my logo and this is my domain where my clients log in. And right here with this platform, we can choose how much we want to charge for these AI bots. As you can see here, this is one of my plans for $97 a month. If we just copy this link right here, we can see what this looks like. This is our checkout page where businesses can buy our software and you can create how many plans that you want. If we just edit this plan right here, right here, you can choose the pricing, what type of AI features you want to include in this plan. You can add a free trial and so on and so forth. Now in this video, I'm not going to go in depth on how to white label go high level, how to create your own plans and pricing, etc. If you want to learn more about how you can do that, I do have a free course that you can check out down below and this course will get you all set up and ready to go. But for right now, I'm going to show you how to build out the AI bot. And to do that, we're going to have to add the business owner to this account. So if you just go over here to sub accounts, right here is where you'll see all of my clients. For you, if you're just starting out, you're not going to see any sub accounts right here. But to add a business owner to your AI software, we're going to want to create the business owner their own sub account. So to do that, we're just going to click right here. We're going to create a blank snapshot. And then right here, we can search for the business's Google My Business profile. Now, if you can't find them on Google My Business or you want to add them manually, you can just come over here. Now on this page right here is where you just want to fill out all of your client's information like their first name, their last name, their email. Right here is where you can add their business name. So for this example, I'm just going to do ABC Pest Control and then we can fill out the rest of this information. Once we're done with that, we can go ahead and save this. Now, once you're done setting up your client to your software, all you want to do is click right here where it says switch to sub account. And now we're going to be entering our client's personal account. So if we come over here, each of our clients will get their own sub account. And again, this is where we can see all of our sub accounts. But for right now, we're going to build the AI bot for our client ABC Pest Control. So to build out this 
this bot we're just going to go over here to settings and then we're going to come over here to conversation ai now in here is where we can set up multiple bots so i'm just going to click right here and then right here you can create a general q a bot or an appointment booking bot we're going to do an appointment booking bot and continue now right here we can name this bot for our client so i can just do something like sarah and then right here we're going to switch on autopilot and what this will do is pretty much just allow this ai bot to turn on it's going to allow the bot to take over any conversation that we want so right here where it says supported channels we can select what type of channels we want this ai bot to respond to so we have whenever someone sends an sms a facebook message instagram message we can have it so whenever someone interacts with your client's chat widget or live chat on their website so you can just come in here and choose whatever channels that your client wants for this example let's just do sms chat widget and live chat and now if we come over here we can add the name of the business right here so again i'm just going to do abc pest control now right here we can add a time delay so if you want the bot to seem more human and you don't want the bot to respond right away you can add a wait time you can add a maximum messages that you want the bot to send out and then right here if you're sending a message manually or through a workflow right here you can have the bot sleep and you can take over that conversation now if we come over here and we go to bot goals this is where we can customize our ai prompt and pretty much a prompt is just the instructions we're going to give the bot so right here we have their personality if you want the bot to be friendly professional you can add that in here you can add their intent and then you can add any additional information and you can create your prompt however you like you're pretty much going to be building the personality of this ai bot and you're also going to give it all of its tasks all of its instructions and pretty much everything that you want the bot to do you can even go to ChatGPT and have ChatGPT help you with this prompt but once you're done filling out this prompt right here you can choose your actions so right here we're going to do appointment booking and right here is where we're going to want to select our client's calendar so i'm just going to select this pest control calendar right here so now our ai bot is going to try to get the leads of our client to book appointments on this calendar right here and then once you do that you can play around with these settings right here and so on and so forth so we're just going to keep everything the same click on save and now what we're going to want to do is train this ai bot to become a complete expert on our client's business so to do that we're just going to go over here to bot training and right here is where we can train this bot so the first thing that we can do is upload any urls our client owns those can be their website any blog pages and so on and so forth so if we just come over here and i'm just going to go to google maps and search for pest control businesses so let's say that we're working with this business right here all you have to do is take their website copy the link of their website go back to our ai bot paste that link right here and now all you have to do is get this data so now what's going to happen is this ai bot is going to scrape that entire website it's going to learn everything there is to know about that business and it's going to pretty much become an expert in the business so whenever a lead has any questions this bot is going to know how to respond so i'm just going to wait for this to load so here we go right here we're going to see all the uploaded links and the more links that you add right here from your client the better this ai bot's going to work the smarter it's going to become but for now this should be good enough now another thing that we can do to make this bot even more powerful is add faqs so if i just click this button right here right here all you want to do is add the most frequently asked questions a lead might ask so this question can be what type of services do you offer and then right here in the answer you can just write out all of your services this can be what time do you close how much do you charge and so on and so forth you can just get all this information from your client if you want to again you can use ChatGPT. ask ChatGPT to give you the most frequently asked questions in a pest control business and you can just add all those questions right here now once you're done setting all this up if you come over here to the right you're going to see where it says test your bot and this is where you can pretend you're a lead interested in the business and start a conversation so if i come over here i'm just going to say hey and we're going to see how this bot responds so here you go the bot said hey there what's on your mind today looking to book a pest control appointment now if you don't want the bot to ask for an appointment right away you're gonna to have to come over here to bot goals and play around with that prompt for example if you have any qualification questions that you want to ask the lead you can just add all those questions right here and if the lead passes all those questions and they seem like they're a good fit that's when you can then have the bot ask for the appointment also as you're having a conversation with this bot if you don't like a response you can just give this a thumbs down and you can just edit this response right here so for this example we can just do hey there how can we help you or something like that now we can click train bot and just like that this ai bot is now trained so now i can come down here and i can just say something like this what type of services do you offer now let's see what this bot says so there you go the bot just said we offer both residential and commercial pest control services including free inspections guaranteed treatments and 24 7 emergency service now it's asking me to book an appointment so i can just say something like sure now it's going to ask me when would I like to book the appointment and I'm going to say something like do you have Wednesday at 3 p.m. open and I'm going to click send. Now what this bot is going to do is check your client's calendar and it's going to see if that day's open right here Wednesday at 3 p.m. is not open so it's going to let me know that and now it's going to give me some suggestions so right here it's going to suggest January 15th and it's going to give me the time slots it's going to ask me which one works for me so I can say 1 p.m. works let's see how the bot responds. 
So just like that, this AI bot automatically booked that appointment on our client's calendar, and it's as easy as that to set up. No longer does your client have to hire a real person to have these conversations. As you can see here, this AI bot is having a real conversation. It's acting as a real person. And if I was a lead communicating with this business, I wouldn't even know this is AI. So like I said before, you can test out this bot. If you don't like a response, just click the thumbs down. You can also come back in here, add more URLs, add more FAQs, and you can also come over here and customize your prompt. So that's pretty much how you can build an AI bot for any type of business. Now for this business right here, ABC Pest Control, anytime a lead sends an SMS or communicates with their chat widget or live chat, this AI bot's going to take over. It's going to nurture that lead and it's going to try to get that lead to book an appointment. Now to sell your AI chatbot to small businesses, you can either use a funnel or a website like this. And this is an example website. I'll pretty much walk the business owner through everything that you offer. They can also come over here, click watch demo. And right here, they can watch this demo video to learn more about your business. They can also come over here to pricing. And right here is where they can buy your software. Now, Go High Level does have a ton of other features as well, as you can see here. So if you want to upsell your client on more features in the future, you can definitely do so if you want to make even more money. But at the very beginning, just keep it simple. Just sell the AI bot and build your software around that one feature. Now, if you don't want to use a funnel or a website, you don't have to you can literally just send the business owner straight to this page right here but if you're going to do that you're definitely going to want to hop on a demo call with them and on this demo call it can just be a quick call all you're going to do is show them how this bot can help their business you can even have the bot text the business owner's phone and they themselves can have a conversation with your bot and test it out in real time if they agree to move forward collect payment set up their account and the business owner is going to be ready to go now like i said before if you want me to go more in depth on how to do this how to set up your software how to find business owners to sell this to how to set them up more in depth again Again, check out the free course that I have down below. Also, if you do want done for you go high level snapshots, go ahead and check out our snapshot vault down below as well. Inside of this vault, we have a ton of snapshots for a ton of different types of niches. So let's say that you're working with a pest control client. All you have to do is upload this pest control snapshot into your go high level account and your client's automatically going to get a ton of assets like funnels, websites, automations, emails, pipelines, calendars, and so on. All done, already built out and all ready to go for your client. So go ahead and also check that out if you're interested. And finally, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.